What's up, you guys? My name is Mary. I'm with High Priestess Intuition. Welcome, my current subscribers, and welcome, 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 newbies. If you guys are new to my channel and you enjoy my content, you can smash the sub button to be notified for future readings. <clears throat> this is a free general collective reading for all signs, Capsu, Sag, ever, and everybody in between. Don't forget the basics. Time is fluid. Energy is fluid. If it doesn't apply, that apply. Everyone has free will. Only take the messages that resonate with the rest. Free general collective reading. Love and appreciate each and every one of you guys. If you'd like to donate to High Priestess Row 5, the link's in the description box below. PayPal only, no cash app, no Venmo. I'm going to go walking after this. I'm in such a wonderful mood. Just saying, just saying. Oh, yeah. Okay. Hope everybody's doing well. Just saying. Okay. So, the channel message is a wonderful one. You know I get crazy, crazy ones in here, and I get good ones. So, this is a good one. So, the channel message I received was, um, um, you passed the test, and I heard that big. You passed the test, and then I heard buckle up, buttercup. Things are about to go fast, fast, fast. Buckle up, buttercup. Just saying, just saying. Buckle up, buttercup. <laughs> so you plug it in how it resonates. So, however, that resonates and applies. Okay, so whoever you are, congrats, man. You passed the test. Now, whoever this is for, I feel this could be. I feel for a lot of you guys, it's um, not a physical test. I don't feel it's a test of strength or a knowledge-based test. I feel it is a, t a test, like a test, real-world test, like a street smarts, um, analytic, like using your head, like you pass the test, like a, not a test that you score an F, a D, a C, a B, or an A on. Like, it's a real-world test. Like, a real-world test. Um, out in the universe is what I feel. Um, and I'm just being for real. I think it's out in the universe style. Common sense. Dealing with people. Dealing with society. Dealing with world and energy and people and situations test. Is what I feel. I don't feel it's like a strong man test, a strong woman test, a test of physical strength, or a writing book smarts test. I think it is a real world test. Hashtag real world test. Congrats, buttercup. You pass. Um, things about to stop moving fast, 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 baby. If that resonates for you. Just saying, just saying, just saying. Oh, yeah. Okay, I feel guided to get Moon Cycle. Actually, no. I feel guided to get these Oracle cards that one of my lovely subscribers sent me. Buckle up, Buttercup. Things are about to start moving fast, fast, fast. Real fast. Real fast. That's double deuces confirmation. Real fast. They're about to start moving real fast, Buttercup. And I feel you can be a masculine or a femme Buttercup. Uh, Buttercup. Just saying, just saying. Spirit messages you have reflected. I'm thinking this is going to be in a positive way because you have passed some kind of test. And I'm just being serious. I'm serious. Now, for some, it might be a physical test. I mean, it might be an intellectual test. It might be a test you're taking in school, college, or um, college, or technical school, or certification, or something like that. Um, or it might be a physical strength test for some. But I feel for a majority of my collective, it is a real world, hashtag real world test. And I'm just being for real. And I'm just being for real. Like a street smart kind of test. Like the kind of test that you just can't measure in a, a testing spectrum on a piece of paper with a scan front, if that makes sense. That's exactly what I think. You passing this test is about to go very, 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 very well for you on many levels. It's about to go very, 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 very negatively for a lot of criminals very soon. Okay. 
So you passing this test is about to go very, 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 very well for you on many levels. So many levels, um, I think, in the universe. And however, on the flip side, it's about to go very negatively for basically a crap ton of criminals. So um, whoever you are, I feel you're high vibrational. I think you treat people honestly, trust, respect, morals, ethics, integrity, and values. And I think it shows. And I think that's part of the test is how you handle people, how you handle situations, how you are handling yourself in whatever. I think you got put in some crazy situation or situations. Um, that was way too many. And I just heard try again. That was way too many. I feel maybe one of you guys, you're, you have addictions or you're dealing with somebody with addictions or you're emotional over a person, people, place, or situation or somebody's emotional over you. Um, because you know, when the cards come out in excess like that, it, it can indicate addictions either in you or somebody you're connected to or emotional, um, heavy emotions either in you or somebody you're connected to. So you plug it in how it resonates. Um, but I do feel emotional energy here with that um, because, and I heard criminals, so maybe some of these criminals have addictions possibly, possibly, um, maybe not. But I do, and I feel intuitively emotional energy there with that. Because, you know, everything that happens in a reading happens for a reason. So, um, I think emotional energy, people can be emotional over you because you have passed some kind of test, sir, ma'am. But it's going to it's gonna go great for you, but downhill quickly, it, I feel, for a lot of criminals. So... Um, I feel these people are about to be emotional over you. Maybe the criminals are going to be emotional over you. Or somebody is going to be emotional over you in a positive way because you have passed some kind of test is what I'm feeling. Wow, you can't make this crap up. Generosity change, 555. I heard it was about to go fast, buttercup, in a positive way. There's your change, your 555 energy. Generosity, transformation, scorpionic energy. Um, number eight. 12 or 23 could be very significant numbers in one's life. 8, 12, or 23. It could be a possible age of a child of yours or somebody you're connected to or any other significant number. 8, 12, or 23. Generosity upright. Change upright. Transformation upright. So we have 555 five, five change energy with the change energy. We have 10 completions of cycles with the transformation. Completions of cycles transforming and changing i.e. with the change energy and it's connected to the change wow man this is this is really beautiful buttercup whoever y'all are buttercup okay i really want to go celebrate like i think i want to go get myself a not an ice cream but like a kind bar from walmart and i know that sounds cliche but i love those kind bars they're so good um and they're so good for you. They're just, they're a little expensive, but they're so good. I don't want ice cream. I want a kind bar or some frozen custard or something. I'm serious. Generosity. You are about to experience huge positive changes in your life. Huge positive changes. For one, you're about to get a mailbox full of gift cards. Holy crap, a moly. Whoa, that's like the best gift ever. Well, if it's to a place that you would use them. Um... You're about to experience a huge positive change. Um, so transformation and change energy. For one, you're about to get a, I heard a mailbox full of gift cards. I mean, what? Um, so generosity, the mailbox full of gift cards. Well, I, you can't go wrong with that if it's a place or place that you, place or places you would use them. Um, I mean, because, you know, for example, like if you get a, 
I heard a mailbox full of gift cards. If you get a mailbox full of gift cards, to, for example, I'm just using this as an example hypothetically. If you get a mailbox full of gift cards to like a place like Belt, which is like a Dillard's for anybody doesn't know, or like a really upscale JCPenney's, but it's called Belt. I've never been in Belt, but I know people that visit Belt. It's, it's a very nice place in a mall. It's kind of like an upscale JCPenney's or a, um, or something of that nature, but, or like a Dillard's. But anyways, uh, if you do not shop at somewhere like Belt and you get a mailbox full of gift cards for somewhere like that, then that's not going to benefit you. But if it's, Somewhere that you do shop, like Walmart or, I don't know, or a gas station or what have you, then and you utilize that gas station or you utilize Walmart or utilize whatever place you're getting sent these, or wh whoever's sending these gift cards to this place, then obviously it will benefit you. But if you plug it in, how it resonate. That's for one of you guys. That's cool. So that's, I heard a mailbox full. So I don't feel it's going to be one. I think it's going to be many. Like, I didn't hear specifically the amount. But a mailbox full? That's a shit ton of gift cards. Generosity. So, somebody's about to be very generous to you. Obviously, they know your address or they're about to find it out. I'll tell you that. Um, and hopefully, it's a to place or places you will utilize these. Um, and I'm just being for real. Because, you know, everybody's different. So, I mean... For one, you have saved somebody's life. They are about to pay it forward to you in a huge way. For one, they are in your community. For one, they are not. For one, you have saved somebody's life. You have saved somebody's life. Wow. Um, now, I don't know if this is physically saving their life, like you pulled them out of a fire, um, either volunteer fire department or, or a citizen or a city police uh, or city fire department. That's just an example. It's just an example. I didn't hear that. Um, just saying, but I'm using that as an example. Like you save somebody's life. So I don't know if it's physically like, for example, pulling somebody physically out of a fire or not. Um, or maybe you're encouraging words or wisdom or advice help save somebody's life. I feel it can go physically, like you physically pulled somebody out from like a moving vehicle or a fire or out from domestic violence or something, or it can go physical or it can go um, not physical, like um, your words, encouraging words save somebody, pull them out of depression or pull them out of a deaths of... Um, wallowing despair or pull them out of addiction or addictions or something like that. I feel it can go both ways. Either you physically save somebody's life or your words or memes or encouraging inspirational message or messages or inspiring advice or something helps save somebody's life. And I feel for one of you guys, that's why you're about to get the mailbox full of gift cards, but you plug it in how it resonates. But, um, for one of you guys, it's somebody in your community you saved their life, either physically or otherwise. For one, it's somebody outside your community. They're about to show generosity. Heard they're about to um, show it the generosity to you in beautiful, wonderful ways. So, um, in a way you would have never expected. In a way you would have never expected. They are about to show it to you in a huge, positive way, in a way you would have never expected. So, generosity, which is going to cause change. Um, and transformation in your life, positive change and transformation. Of course, the mailbox full of gift cards will definitely help out because you're not going to have to pay physical money for item or items wherever you're about to get these gift cards to. So that'll be nice. For the other positive way, um, a big way, a big way, other positive way that somebody's about to pay it forward. One, they live in your community. One, they live outside your community, but it's a very positive big way. So generosity. Um, because you have saved their life, either physically or otherwise. Which is going to create change, change.
This is about to change your life in very positive ways. This is about to change your life in very positive ways. Well, you go with your bad self, sir, ma'am. For one, you're a reader. For one, you're not. For one, you're a reader and one, you're not. So for one, you are a reader and one, you're not. So for one, you were a tarot card reader. I heard a reader, so I feel a tarot card reader. And for one, you were not a tarot card reader. So, um, but it's about to create positive change in your life. One, you are a reader. One, you are an officer of the law. One, you are a, fire, a firefighter. One, you are a nurse. Nurses in the house, positive nurses in the house. I like to see the positive nurses in the house. Just saying, just saying. I pull in so much crazy. I've worked around some crazy ass nurses. So whoever you are, you're a light side nurse. Um, okay, so for one, you're a reader, tarot card reader. And y'all know, like I'm a tarot card reader and a nurse. So, you know, and that's just the truth. But there's upright individuals in occupations and there's not upright individuals in occupations but whoever these people are sirs or ma'ams you're upright in your occupation well you truly are one you're a tarot card reader and you could be more than one of these occupations like i said i take on double occupation and there's many other occupations i want to take on in my life when i can many more adventures i'm 39 years young i'm gonna live it up until i'm 99 years young and that's just the truth until i can't can't no more so, um, for one, you are a light side tarot card reader. For one, you are a light side fire firefighter. One, you are a light side officer of the law. And when you are a light side nurse, I feel this can be an R RN, LPN, LVN, or a CRNP, or any other kind of nurse. How that resonates and applies, light side nurse. And then the light side officer of the law, light side firefighter, light side tarot reader. So, light side spiritualist energy. Um, it's about to create positive change to, for you and transformation, positive transformation. About to create such huge tra positive transformations in your life. About to change your life for the better, but you have been so good to other people it's a time for you to get it back and you're about to get it okay i heard it's about to change your life in such a beautiful way positive transformate transformative kind of way um but i heard it, uh, it's time for you to get it back so it's time in the universe for you to get back all the good you've been putting into the universe basically light side firefighter light side officer of the law light side um tarot card reader spiritualist light side nurse um, how that resonates and applies okay it's time for you to get it back so i feel maybe there has been no give and take no cop copacetic energy exchange like you've been given 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 in a positive upright light side manner um either in your occupation or career or off duty um or not or i, I feel you 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 are who you say you are in in your role professional career role over here and outside your professional career role if that makes sense I, I i think you walk the talk and you you walk the talk and you talk the talk this is exactly what i think 100 percent real 100 percent real is what i just heard you're 100 percent real so you keep it real you do you keep it real and you're upright um uh, whoever you are i don't feel it's been paid to you correctly the way it should have it should be paid to you in your career i feel for some it might be underpaying jobs or not being paid enough or not being maybe um not getting bonuses other people get bonuses or not getting treated fairly in your workspace or at home or both or in your community or you're putting 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 in in a positive light side manner but you're not getting back what you should be getting back either in physical mon monetary compensation or energy exchange with other people um like you're putting all this good into the universe and you're putting all this good into the universe but you're not getting people aren't positively copacetically giving back to you the way they should and you're putting all this in is what i feel there's at least four of you in here but you plug it in how it resonates but things are about to change for you in a very positive way this is such a beautiful reading man i wasn't even going to do one today i was just going to celebrate my diversion program completion and that's just the truth 
Um, and somehow criminals about to really, really go down, you about to go up in a very positive way, sir, ma'am, light side firefighter, light side officer of the law. And these can be masculine and feminine, by the way. Light side firefighter, light side officer of the law, light side um, spiritualist, tarot card reader, light side uh, nurse. You going up is about to cause criminals to go down. But that's good. We want the criminals to go, go, go down. I don't care if the criminal has $5 in their bank account or $5.5 billion. And that's just the truth. I mean, think of what's his name. Uh, evil dude. Um, oh, my God. Um, Epstein. Jeffrey Epstein, man, and his little sidekick, Chickadoo. Um, rich, rich, so rich. Those people were so rich, so rich. Filthy rich off the backs of kids and prostitution, basically. But their morals and their values and their ethics and their integrity was to shit. But yet they were so super filthy rich. But they yet they still ended up behind bars. And they should have. And they absolutely should have. Uh, what was her name? Giswell? Giswell? Maxine? Maxine Giswell or Giswell or something. Um, I think the rest of those people should have went down too. Not just those two. I think their whole group should have went down. But I'm not the one that makes the rules for them. That's just the truth. But, I mean, I'm serious. But that's a start. It's a start. You know what I'm saying? Anyways, um, uh, but yeah, that's what this reminds me of. You guys are about to go up. You fight against in injustice, I feel. True injustice. You fight against in inequality, true, in in true injustices, and you really put good out in the universe. I just don't feel it's gotten returned back to you the way it should have, and it's about to. For some, you could be a Scorpio or have Scorpio in your chart, possibly, because we have the Scorpionic energy. If you do, you have, uh, could have Scorpio in your sun, moon, rising, Venus, North Moon, and Hammer, Jupiter charts, if you do. That's the only sign I saw on here with the signs, with the cards, um, but you really could, it could be any sign. You could be any sign over here, okay? All right, I'm closing it. This was beautiful. If you think anyone else will like my channel or like the messages, uh, please feel free to share my channel very publicly on social media and word of mouth. It helps support a single mom and two kids um, and one of her income streams. I really help support, uh, help, really appreciate all the love and support to the channel. It helps. It helps. It helps. Love you guys. Namaste.